What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back on Madden 19. Um, probably starting next week. I think I have a video up to go up tomorrow. Uh, it's a game changer bundle. I think it's a pretty terrible game changer bundle, but I have that to go up. And then I think starting next week we'll be back to being able to uh, upload on a regular basis. Um, still doing a lot of helping uh, my mom out uh, with her with her elbow and whatnot, and taking her to a couple of appointments here and there, but uh, I, I think I'm getting close to being able to, uh, where she won't need me as much anymore. So let's hop into this though. We've got three new legends. So we'll start out with the uh, we'll start out with the Tim Brown, which is a 91 overall, actually fairly reasonably priced. Oh my gosh, this card is actually a monster. I might. I might get this thing over AB. So I have the not. Ignore my coins. I'm working on Team Diamonds. My coins don't matter. Um, I have somewhere in the ballpark a 3 million or something like that. Um, point being, though, I might actually trade out the Antonio Brown here for An or for Tim Brown. Um, I have a auctionable tradable Antonio Brown as the power-up, so I can, uh, I can actually make the switch if I want. I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do yet, um, but that's actually a lot closer. That's pretty close. I have a lot of interest in this Tim Brown. We'll go over the stats though. 88 speed. Let's go to the here. So we have 88 speed, 91 agility, 90 excel, 91 awareness, 89 catching, 84 carry, uh, 84 jumping, 90 kick return, 88 elusiveness, 89 ball carrier vision, 84 spin move, 88 juke move, 82, why does he have, he has good coverage stats, 82 man and 76 zone, uh, 88 stamina, 86 back catch, 88 catch in traffic, uh, 90 short route running, 89 medium route running, only 82 deep route running, um, probably best as a flex slot type player, uh, beat press 85. This is a really nice legend. I, I I had like no interest in the Tim Brown going in, and then after seeing his stats right here, I am uh, I am super interested. Oh, you know what? I'm looking at the wrong thing. Our next legend is Demarcus Ware, and I always forget that he's. I always think he's an end because I'm used to him rushing and sacking and stuff like that. But he he's an he's an outside linebacker. Um, I see that 82 speed. Uh, 82 speed, 84 agility, 86 excel, 91 awareness, uh, 85 tackle. Would have liked to see that be a little bit better. 70, 73 jumping's not bad. Impact blocking, 86. 90 power move, 84 finesse. Uh, 88 block shed, 87 pursuit, 91 play rec. Interesting. I've been bringing 83 hit power. I've been bringing my linebackers on a lot more blitzes and going a lot more... Um, playing, what am I trying to say, playing man-to-man um, -man on the outside, press man-to-man, -man. so I actually have some decent interest in that. And uh, now we have the limited legend, which is Kevin Mawai. Uh, he was in, was he in Madden? He, I just remember him as the ghost card in Madden 13, 13? 14? 13 or 25, he was a ghost card. See quick sell for 250k. That's all that. Yeah, okay, so he sells quick sells for 200 or 500k. So if we start getting ones again around like 515, I'll buy one and put them on the team. It's a million coins on your team that you could quick sell at any time and get your coins back. So if he gets down a little bit cheaper, I'll end up buying him and throwing him on the team. Uh, but we'll take a look at his stats. So he's got 90 strength, 62 speed, and 75 excel are not bad. 92 awareness. This would be a great anchor as well for the center, since he's a center. Anchor your line with Kevin Mawai. Uh 92 pass block, 89 run block. I do think I'm going to end up picking him up. 87 impact blocking. He's already pretty cheap. Uh, 88 injury, 86 stamina. I still have last week's limited legend um, on my team as well, because I can just quick sell him for 500k. But let's hop into this. We got 8 legend fantasies in the 86+. plus. So let's see if we can let's see if we can get some luck like we had last week. We're not pulling anything out of the silver round. I'm just going to assume we're not gonna pull anything out of the silver round, so I'm just gonna go quickly through that every time because 
Oh, oh, the double. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. The triple, the triple elite. You got to come on. I got to, I got to leave a Bradley Roby. I don't even know. I'm going to take Cooper, even though I don't know which one is more valuable. Dante Hightower. All right. Demario Davis isn't bad. Legend is okay. 85 to Marcus Ware. We will take that. That's a, that's a beastly first pack. We got Tim Brown and Demarcus Ware in our first Legend Fantasy. I mean, I can. That's a that's an insane Legend Fantasy pack. In terms of pulls, I mean, obviously not like crazy in terms of price, but oh my gosh, we got we oh my gosh, we got a power up and a gold out of the silver round. All right, we're not gonna we're not gonna pull any elites this time. All right, so we'll take. Actually, hold on. Are any of these guys... No, none of them are from the teams that I still have to do for the Team Diamonds. Alright, Glover Quinn. And Big Ben. What's our legend? Alright, 84 Tim Brown. I'll take the 84 Tim Brown. Maybe we'll be able to complete the entire Tim Brown legend by the time I open up all these fantasy packs. Alright, Michael Clark. Take the high overall ones. Why not? Uh, nothing out of that. Let's take Malcolm Brown and Tory Smith. I still have a bunch of golds to sell. So I'm not looking forward to selling those. Jason McCourty and the legend Demarcus Ware. We're pulling Demarcus Ware's and Tim Brown's like crazy. Um. But no, I have like 500 gold still to sell. It's going to be absolutely ridiculous. And I've been buying Game Changer packs with coins. They've actually paid off. Ooh, look at that Richard Sherman. That Sherman's probably got a little bit of value with his prime time out now. His prime time performer. Cam Irving. Ooh, Shaq Mason. Getting that elite. Or, uh, do I have the... I have the Ravens done. Oh, well, I'll take it anyway. All right. Brian Anger, we're going to go with the Legend second this time. Usually I wait. I should have waited. Devin McCourty or Brian Anger. I'm just going to take McCourty because I don't want to take a punter. The punter is probably equivalent value. I just don't want to take the punter. Alright. Four more of these to go. Uh, I'll take take the core rookie. All golds, all golds. Um, do I still need to do? No, I did the Texans already. Okay, I've done all these teams, so give me those two. C.J. Anderson. All right, Carson Wentz, not a bad pull, and Bruce Smith. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take Carson Wentz. I don't know if Carson Wentz is more expensive than Bruce Smith or not, but we're gonna take Car we're gonna take Carson Wentz. Three more of these to go. Can we find? I don't know. I would like to get like an 87 or something like that. I'm not. I don't. I'm not asking for like Aaron Rodgers or some crazy high pull. I just am. You know. Oh, look at that, Chris Jones and Rashad Penny. It's a nice little round there. I'm just, I, you know, I just take something medium. Okay, okay, Deion Jones. I'll take that. I'll take that Deion Jones. That's not bad pull. But uh, come on, come on, give me, give me a medium, like an 88. Give me like an 88, 87, 88. My final pack does not count. That does not count as my 87, 88. So, okay, don't need any of those guys. Jerry Hughes, another Devin McCourty. So we're taking the middle. Oh, it's really rough. Never mind. Uh, I'll take McCourty. <laughs> okay, so we got one pack left. Is it one pack? One pack and then the 86 plus legend player. I mean, I probably didn't meet value by value standpoints on this bundle. Just, just 
you know, doing math in my head. Oh, Jay Ajayi. That's not bad. All right, Mariota. Ooh, another Deion Jones. It doesn't really matter what I get here, but it's another DeMarcus Ware. Uh, I actually don't know which one will have more value, Deion Jones. We're going to have to look this up because I don't actually know. I don't, I don't know what's worth more, D-Ware or Deion Jones. Uh, Deion Jones is 50k. How much is DeMarcus Ware? Why did it do this to me? All right, my head, what are you doing? I'm about to just, I'm about to just, DeMarcus Ware, search. What do you, what is this? Okay, so I think it's 29K for the 85. Yeah, it's 29K. No, oh, definitely Deion Jones, definitely Deion Jones. All right, here we go. Here we go, 86 plus legends player pack. What am I going to get? Boom. Okay, Ted, 86 Ted Hendricks. 86 Ted Hendricks. That's about that. That's about the worst thing that I could have pulled right there. It's up there for one of the worst things I could have pulled. So I will probably hold on. You can see I have Team Diamonds in here that I have to sell that I haven't sold. Like, Xavier Rhodes by himself is 700k. So, um, Newest Quality Elites. So we pulled Ted Hendricks, we pulled two 85 Deion Jones, we pulled two Devin McCordy's, a Jay Ajayi, Shaq Mason, Carson Wentz, Chris Jones, a couple of D-Ware pieces, a couple of Tim Brown pieces, we pulled Amari Cooper, which is this Tim Brown going for? Alright, they're in the 20Ks at least. I'm going to hold on to them for now and wait for middle of the week, that's kind of when Legends spike. Like, I'll, I'll use Sean Taylor as an example, so... Let's go look at Sean Taylor's price right now. He might not have gone up in price that much because he's a desire, or gone down in price that much because he's kind of a desirable card, but I could be wrong. We'll see. Yeah, he's about the same price. He's about the same price. I sold mine the... I mean, I haven't made a profit off of him when, whenever I buy him back because I'm going to buy him back, but I sold him like three nights ago for like 430k or something like that. So I would make about 20k if I bought one right now, but I'm just gonna I'm gonna hold off for the time being, um, and I'll probably try to snipe some pieces uh, once I finish up the team diamonds because I got to finish up the team diamonds. But yeah, guys, that's gonna do it for this episode. Um, I'll have a team update coming soon. Uh, obviously, I'm gonna buy that Kevin Mawai, and so we'll go from there. But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.